This is at the Art Institute in Chicago if you want to see it live. And what she's trying to pick up on is that idea of being above the clouds. And there's a lot of possible interpretations here. She's 77. This could be her looking at her own mortality, uh, imagining her view. When... O'Keefe captures her impression of the sky at about 30,000 feet on a flight out west. Interestingly, O'Keefe took her first air flight when in her 70s, and the experience seemed to evoke an almost childlike excitement, an enthusiasm for travel, exploration, adventure, and escape. In New York, I painted in the studio. Well, in New Mexico, I painted out my car most of the time. It was nice of Stieglitz to let you go to New Mexico every summer. Oh, listen, he didn't let me go. I just went. Georgia O'Keeffe was a 20th century American painter and pioneer of American modernism. She is best known for her canvas paintings depicting flowers, skyscrapers, animal skulls, and southeastern landscapes. Georgia O'Keeffe was born on November 15, 1887 on a wheat farm in Sun Prairie, Wisconsin. She believed that the bones and skulls were as beautiful as the flowers she had painted. She painted in any weather and during strong rains and wearing gloves during cold, freezing temperatures, rigging her tents with thick tarps. She painted outdoors and went camping and rafting even in her 70s. <laughs> 